I'm starting to feel like I'm not the best person to ask for advice. But here I am telling you what to do, whether you like it or not. White is the color of flowers in springtime. Red the color of blood through my veins. Blue is the color of when you were leaving. Tell Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today is a very special vlog. This video is going to be about important people in your life moving away. Okay, story time. So my best friend got pregnant in the beginning of the year and uh, she and her boyfriend are moving across the country up north and it's happening tomorrow. I'm not prepared. We have basically not spent exactly every single day together for the past five years, but if we could, we probably would. So it's gonna be a big change and I'm not looking forward to it, but I'm so happy for them both and I cannot wait for, first of all, for the baby to come. I've never been excited about kids, but I mean, it's gonna be Yvonne's little baby. <laughs> they are moving up north tomorrow, so this is the last full day of them being down here. And I haven't seen them in four days. Probably should have taken my time, but I'm gonna be there at the airport tomorrow night um, and I also done this thing where I've printed out this little photo of her and her little belly and I've written kind of a <laughs> really sappy goodbye note on the back and my goal with this like Yvonne I know you're watching I really want you to read this on a plane and just cry, okay? I want you to pe feel the pain. <laughs> Last time we were together was on her kind of like baby shower slash she is moving away in five days. Uh, so I'll insert some clips of that now. This video was a complete disaster um, and I kind of felt like abandoning it but then I told myself that this is something I do want in the future um, so yeah here I am gonna go through what's been going on since that last clip you saw um, basically I was supposed to meet my best friend at the airport the day she left but 
Um, I was sitting on the train ready to go to the airport, but then there was something wrong. So we just stood there for like 15-20 minutes and then I basically missed the flight that she was going on. So I didn't get the chance to say goodbye, um, which absolutely sucked. Instead of having this amazing heartbreaking goodbye, it's just gonna be me explaining tricks, I guess, to deal with loved ones moving far away. Uh, my first thing that I will be doing, and I'm so excited, is I do plan on sending like a little photo of us every single month, um, which is a secret and I know you're watching this Yvonne, so shh, don't tell yourself. So that would be my first advice, is to just find something to do regularly so you know that that friendship or whatever don't fall apart. Not that I believe it will fall apart because she's gonna be back here in November and I know that these next years are gonna go by like that and then all of a sudden she'll be back here with me and <laughs> we can have our movie nights and whatnot. I'm being very dramatic about this, I know. And my second tip is to just save some money and go and visit and I cannot wait to go up there and visit. Actually I do, I can wait because it's it's northern Norway, you don't really want to go up and visit, it's cold and eh. Uh. I'm really looking forward to go up there and visit and I mean not only visit her and Kevin but I mean they, in October they're gonna be a baby there as well. Don't let the distance like move you apart because there's so many ways to stay connected in these days. Um, so there's not really an excuse. But at the same time, it's also important to just take care of yourself. I guess it sounds. It. I feel like I make it sound like I broke up with someone. I'm really over exaggerating this. I know. I'm fully aware. Do things that you still want to do and continue working on your own life and then everybody else's life will just work along yours I guess. I'm not the best at advice and on that note I'm gonna say goodbye because I have other things to do like play Witcher 3 so I'm gonna go and do that. Um, yeah I'll see you in the next video.